Okay, well, let's have a word of prayer, then we'll get into our message for today. Father, we're looking at the spiritual warfare. We're, we're involved. It's always been since the day of Christ, Lord, he said it would happen. And it's each generation. But, Lord, we're seeing something more definite for us today than what we here in our country have suffered. And, Lord, I pray you'd help us remain true, true to the Word, through it all. True to Christ. True to stand and true to endure. Now, Lord, if there's anyone under the sound of my voice today who does not know that if they died today, that heaven's their home, I pray that today would be the very day they come to know Jesus Christ as their Savior. If there's any who has wandered from you, may today be the day to come home. And I'd ask this in Jesus Christ's most precious and holy name. Amen. <clears throat> I did a series on the rapture that we finished up before the revival meeting started. And uh, I had a purpose for inserting that little series there because it was looking at things that would say, most, most things, as a matter of fact, I think Dr. Comfort did that, looked at a lot of things that were happening in the uh, tribulation and just kind of settled on things that were happening in the tribulation and how things are building that. And that's not what I was looking for. Uh, although we had some things that are happening in tribulation, but I was more seeing things going on right now. And I wanted you to see that the, the right now things are looking at the rapture, not the tribulation. But I wanted to do that.